Let code number 204 count primes. Uh, this is an easy question. Let's get into it. Count the number of prime numbers less than a non negative number n. Uh, let's check the example. Input is the 10. Uh, 0 is the not non prime. 1 also non prime. 2 is the prime. 3 also prime. 4 is able to divide 2, 5 is flying, 6 is able to divide 2 or 3, 7 is flying, 8 is able to divide 2, 9 is divide 3, and then 10 is divide 2. So 1, 2, 3, 4. Return 4. How you can get flying? Okay, let's start with the proper solution. Uh, proper solution, I will gonna uh, make uh, function determine this value is prime or not and uh, after that I will iteration 0 to 10 and the count the prime value but at this time time complexity is n square learning function linear and then uh, iterate the number also linear and then okay I will implement it there first and then later I will uh, introduce you uh, the better solution. So first let me make each flying and then input num and iteration for i in range from 2 to the n. So if num divide i is 0, that means is able to divide it. I will return first and then if we cannot any the divide the, the value I will return 2 in this case let's put in the 2 2 is 2 to the 2 so it did not run so return 2 so it itself did not run this fly function so later I will do the i in range from 2 to the n and then if is flying i then i increase the counter and then return counter and i add one counter here in the subject zero and then we need it to uh, take a carriage case if n is the below 3 2 we need to return 0 because 0 1 is not a fly okay but in this case time complex is n square so when I submit the code it uh, time exceed error occur so we need to find a better solution the name is Name is this one. See Bob Eratosinenis. So the uh, idea of this one is okay, let n is 10. At this time, I make the value uh, size is uh, the 11 because it starts from 0, and then I feel all the value is true. So this one index 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So first the 0, 1 is uh, not flying, so I, I will turn off the boss item about A and then I will start with the 2 and then uh, I will start to 2 and then at that time the start value did not turn off, so it will start to from here turn off for first and then 6 also first and then uh, 8 first 10 first and then later 3 leave it and 6 first this one already first 9 first and then 4 in case 4 8 already first 
5 10 over the 8 first so now we made the uh, table so finally we just check the true value 1 2 3 4 because all of them is the prime number so concept is that the make the table and then uh, turn up the multiple number and then that means the, the delete not prime number and then finally only prime number is left in a table so I will implement this one okay first uh -huh. let me make edge case let me control edge case first and then I made array a is the fill with 2 and plus 1 and then I will start iteration before iteration I will turn off a 0 is first and then a 1 also first and then iteration for i in range from 2 to the n plus 1 because we need also the in cloud n so next j in range from i if i start to the i this one also turn off right how we can prevent it yes that's right just start with i square so in this case 2 square 4 is the start so and then 2 is the did not turn off and then and to the one and increase i by i so in this case for six eight ten then i will a j i will turn off and then after finish that i will iteration again range n plus one and then if a I is the turn on I will add the counter zero and then finally return comma okay in this case the uh, time complexity is oops two up G1 expect zero why? I think 2 is uh, 2 is uh, I think 2 is the 1 isn't it? ok let me check one more time 2 count 0 0 1 plus and plus 1 2 2 2 and plus 1 is not prime number I think 2 is prime number isn't it ah the less than okay then is we needed to 10 minutes did not include that one less than minutes Learn again. It's up to index out of range. Okay. Okay, now it's learn. And then, okay, there, there are one more the T. Okay. Uh, after over the half the the duplication is occur that means you know two multiply four is same as four multiply two so we just uh, uh, check only the root n so we will reduce the this one here only check the half so integer 
root and even we do this one uh, after this thing index SQLTN mm -hmm. Is correct. If the, this one is the uh, odd number, we needed to add one. So here plus one. Okay, now it's okay. In this case, we reduce the time complexity. So okay, let's calculate the complexity. Time complexity is this one is even this one is the loop to, uh, loop in loop. But as you see, this one they iterate only the log, uh, root n, and then this one also iterate uh, for n time. So finally, this is linear time. So this one also linear time, and that space is linear space. So linear time with linear space. Thank you.